Welcome to this playlist about algebraic fractions. You can get two types of questions. You can be asked to combine two algebraic fractions, or you can be asked to simplify a particular fraction. Yeah, and in the next few videos, uh, we will discuss both types of questions, okay? But just to go back to the basics, what are fractions? I'm not going to explain everything uh, about fractions, of course, but when we're adding fractions, uh, what needs to be the same, yeah? So if I, for instance, have three over seven plus two over seven, can I combine, can I add these two fractions? Yes, I can, because the denominator at the bottom side is the same, a seven, so three sevens and two sevens will be five sevens, yeah? five over seven. All right, but in a different situation, for instance, if I have um, four over five plus one over 10, I cannot, in this format, just simply add these two fractions, yeah? And why is that? Because denominators are not the same, yeah? So I have to manipulate uh, yeah, the question, I have to find a, a common uh, multiple, if you like, and then if I would multiply the first fraction by two over two, so four over five is equivalent to eight over 10 plus one over 10, now the two denominators are the same, so the answer to that would be nine over 10. Yeah. Okay, so please make sure you understand the basics of fractions before now we go to algebraic fractions. Yeah? And I'm just gonna give you one example question and then we will move on to, to the next video for some harder questions. But what is an example question of an algebraic fraction? Well, for instance, a over three plus b over three. Yeah, and nobody said that maths is particularly difficult because this is going to be a plus b over 3, yeah, because the denominator is the same. But I could also get a over 3 plus b over 6. Can I add these two fractions? Well, I can only add fractions if the denominator is the same. Well, it's not the same, so I have to manipulate the question, yeah, I have to find a common multiple, and a common multiple is 6, so 2a over 6 plus b over 6, and that will be 2a plus b over 6. Okay, two example questions already about algebraic fractions. Please go to the next video for more complicated questions um, in this format, yeah? But you can only answer these with confidence if you understand the basics, okay? So explainingmaths.com, uh, check the site for more free resources, yeah? And now off to the next video for more example questions. I'll see you there.